Welcome back to my studio. I'm Bea Grob and I love to inspire you. It is all about art journaling, painting, collage, assemblages and anything else that sparks my interest. So enjoy! Hello everybody, welcome back to my studio. So glad you are here again today. Uh, it is between Christmas and New Year and I come to you with um, mostly time-lapse video because we're gonna have a new video hop and with me I mean Eleni's from Eleni's Art Stuff and Mixed Creativity by Marie and myself, Mixed Media Bear Group. We decided we're gonna have a new video hop every first Friday in the month starting on January. And uh, for that occasion we decided we're gonna have, because we live all in Europe, it is easy to send stuff around. So we're gonna do, each of us gonna do for the other two A5 backgrounds. So, and for that occasion, I'm gonna use my large jelly plate. And besides that, I'm gonna use some of my stamps, some of my stencils. I'm gonna use also doilies, not so much for having colored doilies, but to have the print of the doilies. And I'm working on a mixed media paper of A4 size, so I can cut it in half, so they get both from the same style, the print. Obviously, it's not going to be the, exactly the same, but because, yeah, you know, it's jelly print. So I'm going to do theirs on the mixed media paper, but I also have a bunch of... Uh, plain computer paper because sometimes I rather want the second print for to be the actual background for their artwork than what you pull off first. And for mediums I gonna use acrylic paint, acrylic ink, alcohol ink, but I also gonna use shimmer sprays and I always gonna start with the metallic silver and I probably gonna end up with the Titan Buff Light. Um, uh, yeah, that's what I have planned. Is it all I gonna use? I don't know, maybe in the middle of the session I decide I want something else. If there is something else I gonna use, I gonna put it somewhere on the screen so you actually know what I gonna use. Okay, now I'm going to change cameras and going to start working. Now, as you can see, I don't clean my plate, so there's going to be leftovers from other projects, but that is totally fine with me. This is a metallic silver. And uh, obviously those sprays, they have metallic they have sheen also with mica powders, but the rest are... No, that's not true. The, that's a pearlescent too, but other, all the other paints are just plain paints.
Okay, I'm done with jelly printing. I have chosen some papers I want to use and did they cut them in half so that I have like six A5 sizes for Eleni and six A5 sizes approximately for Marie. Now, I have already started here. I did add more mark making. I'm going to show it just real quickly on two papers and the rest I'm going to do off camera. It's nothing. Um, it's not science. It's not rocket science. Anyone can do that. First of all, I'm going to use my stamps uh, to make with the permanent stays on black ink some sort of mark making. I'm not going for perfect um, clear stamps. I just want to like something going on in the background like visual texture and I'm gonna real quick change camera now so that you can see the whole table. So I'm not pressing too hard to start with and as I said it's not about perfect stamping it's more something going on in the background. And I have here a small jelly plate and gesso and I do have a roller where I have added like a lace fabric so I'm gonna use that to making more marked and also lighten up the whole background a little bit. I mean those Marie and Eleni are free to add more gesso afterwards but I just thought I'm gonna lighten it already a little bit and because of the the yeah here you can see it that's the kind of pattern I get with this roller that's what I'm gonna do to all my papers and then I'm gonna send them off to Marie and Eleni that's it for today's video um, don't forget to hop to the other two I'm gonna have the links down below and we we'll see you on 7th of January for our first three girls 12 faces challenge we have set up for ourselves see you soon take care bye